Good morning, everyone. Virgo here. It is August 23rd, 2019. Happy Friday to everyone. Um, I have some breaking news. David Koch, the uh, billionaire conservative and philanthropist, has died at age 79. So his brother reported this this morning. It's uh, breaking all over the internet at the moment. I'll be linking some of the uh, articles to the description of this video so that you can take a look at them if you'd like. There's, uh, this is kind of a developing story apparently, so I'm going to be reading what information there is currently, but you might want to keep your eyes open if you want uh, additional information regarding this because it does seem to be something that is developing as it goes. David Koch, billionaire, conservative activist, and philanthropist, has died. He was 79. Quote, it is with a heavy heart that I announce the passing of my brother David, Charles Koch said in a statement Friday. Anyone who worked with David surely experienced his giant personality and passion for life, end quote. David and Charles co-owned Koch Industries, a Kansas-based energy and chemical company since 1983. David stepped down from running the Koch organization last year due to declining health issues. Um, the brothers tied as the 11th richest in the world in a ranking by Forbes. With the billions from their businesses, the Koch brothers helped to build a massive conservative network of donors and organizations that work to mobilize voters and sway elected officials in support of libertarian-leaning economic policies. The network, led by the nonprofit Americans for Prosperity, has spent more than $1 billion over the past several elections to support candidates that adhere to their free market, small government, libertarian ideals. The organization sometimes split with the GOP, um, over President Donald Trump, it launched a multi-million dollar campaign last year promoting free trade and warning against the tariffs. David Koch, a prostate cancer survivor, also donated hundreds of millions of dollars to medical research. He was also a huge supporter of the arts in New York City, notably donating to Lincoln Center and $65,000 million to support a renovation of the Metropolitan Museum of Art. When Koch was diagnosed with cancer 27 years ago, he was given five years to live, his brother said. His brother said, quote, David liked to say that a combination of brilliant doctors, state-of-the-art medicines, and his own stubbornness kept the cancer at bay. The brother's statement said, we can all be grateful that it did because he was able to touch so many more uh, lives as a result. So, as I said, this is a developing story. So, um, you guys might want to go ahead and take a look at uh, the new developments as they come across over the next day or so. I will link a few of the articles that are um, ver you know ha that have verified this information for you to take a look at in the description of the video. But uh, once again, David H. Koch, age 79, has died. All right, everyone, I will uh, see you soon with another video.